Today is March 29th, on which we commemorate John Keeble, priest. John Keeble, a vicar's son, was born in 1792, educated at Oxford, and ordained in 1815. His volume of poetry, The Christian Year, was published in 1827 and would become wildly popular, in fact, the most popular book of poetry of the whole 19th century in England. Keeble's success as a poet gained him an appointment as the chair of poetry at Oxford. There he, along with John Henry Newman and Edward Pusey, would become a leading voice of the nascent Oxford movement. It was Keeble's 1833 Assize Sermon that truly launched the movement that would call all Anglicans back to the ancient beauty and reverence of their Catholic roots. Unlike Newman, Keeble firmly believed that one could be truly Catholic and Anglican, and he remained faithful to the Church of England. In 1835, Keeble left Oxford and would live out his life among his family as a faithful country priest. He died on this day in 1866. In the Christian year, John Keeble wrote, There's not a strain to memory dear, nor flower in classic grove. There's not a sweet note warbled here, but minds us of thy love. O Lord, our Lord, and spoiler of our foes, there is no light but thine. With thee all beauty glows. Let us pray. Grant, O God, that in all time of our testing, we may know your presence and obey your will, that following the example of your servant John Keeble, we may accomplish with integrity and courage what you give us to do, and endure what you give us to bear. Through Jesus Christ, our Lord, who lives and reigns with you and the Holy Spirit, one God, forever and ever. Amen.